Sent on their way from the 2400 metre marker. Not a bad beginning in this one. Mama Pajama Preferential, Cherry Road, Chitengo's been ridden at. Electric Surge is near the rail and Jasmine between runners. There's four or five of them lining up. Flickety by far, keep on dancing, then comes Glory Days, Catch a Falling Star, and Silver Magic's about 10, 11 lengths off that leader, as Mama Pajama overcame the draw, is now setting the fractions. Chichengo is back in second position, then Preferential, they are followed by Cherry Road, who's back in that fourth position, they are followed further back by Electric Surge. Electric Surge at this stage is about six or seven off the leader. And then comes Jasmine. That's in the red silk. It's on the move as they go down to the 1500. Catch a falling stars on the outside of runners. Further back is Glory Days. Keep on dancing. Flickety by far. And continuing to trail a silver magic about 10, 11 lengths off the leader. Mama Pajama continues to lead it. In second is Chitengo. Cherry Road's in that third spot. And then comes Preferential. Catch a Falling Stars going around them. And Catch a Falling Stars moving within striking distance of the lead. And then Electric Surge. They're followed by Jasmine. Flickety by far. Then Keep on Dancing behind that Silver Magic. And Glory Days the trailer. 12, 13 lengths now top to tail. Track and Ball Oaks now moves to the 900 metre region and catch a falling star by two. Mama Pajamas back in that second position. On the outside is Cherry Road and Chitengo's just waiting at the rail. Jasmine Preferential keep on dancing. Electric Surge then behind that Silver Magic. Flickety by fine glory days. Top of the lane they come with about 500 metres to go in the track and ball oaks. And it's Mama Pajama. Towards the outside, catch a falling star. Chitengo goes in. Cherry Road is on the outside. They are followed by Preferential. Keep on dancing, trying to start up the motor as they come down to the 200 metre. Catch a falling star. Mama Pajama's fighting right back. Jasmine's trying to put in a claim. Keep on dancing, Chitengo. Mama Pajama, keep on dancing's a big runner on the outside and running on a silver magic keep on dancing electric surge taking on keep on dancing one electric surge second photo third mama pajama or silver magic How's this for a win? Number 11, keep on dancing. The Silvano, Wendy Whitehead for the Nicholas and Warren Kennedy again. And they win it. And they win it well by about a length and a quarter. So keep on dancing. Six win from 16 outings. And Victoria, second, number two, Electric Surge. Third place, probably number 10, the Silver Magic. Fourth place, Mama Pajama, Jasmine. And they were then followed by Chitengo, Catch a Falling Star. And as we look at this, the winner, two off the right-hand side, Keep on Dancing, number 11, 460 and 170. Runs on well. Towards the left-hand side, Mama Pajama, Electric Surge, also runs a cracking race. Jasmine's on the inside, and towards the outside, Silver Magic, but the track and ball oaks goes to number 11, keep on dancing. The tight favourite, number 9, Chitengo. Back to the studio. Right, we've just seen the running of the track and ball oaks, a grade two race, and uh, what a terrific race it's turned out to be. And uh, I've got Colin Furry, who's come through as the COO for track and ball. He's going to be handing out the trophies to a, a delighted team. And uh, we'll start with the winning jockey because they've got to get back first. Oh, but I've got the winning groom. Well done. Excellent stuff. And uh, African Kumbesi is the winning groom of this horse. Well done to him. He looks off to keep on dancing. Back to back wins for him as well. Thank you very much. All right, now we're going to bring Warren in. 
Warren, the, your third winner of the day. Yes, thanks. Well sir. done. Yeah. Uh, same as the horse you won off me. Not a big Silvano, but turns it on and, and guts here. Absolutely, Mr. Left. Small filly, a lot of guts. Uh, temperamental, but um, we are, Wendy's on top of her. And uh, look, her assets to turn a foot, Mr. Left, like I said in the, in the pre previous races. If I could get to, I said to Wendy, if I can get a midfield without any hassle and switch her off, she can turn it on. I just have to be a bit conservative knowing that she's going to 2-4 for the first time. But um, look, at the gates, i got a, a beautiful spot. And from there, I was pretty confident, you know. Yeah. She switched off beautifully. She actually didn't travel at all with me. I just stoke up going around the last turn just to, to get a mind on the job. But when I showed her daylight, she quickened really well. And she, she stayed on all the way to the line. I won't say she found all the way to the line. She, she found to the front and stayed on to the line. So a lovely win. Big well to Wendy. To the owners, to, to everyone involved, uh, it's a fantastic win. Lovely for Wendy to get a, a Group 3 in champion season. One of the smaller trainers, and she's done a fantastic job with this filly. She's very hot, very temperamental, and Wendy's really got on top of her and, and has brought it through really well. Yeah, one last question. When I was watching the race, I thought Mum Pajama got them all worried coming up the stretch. Absolutely. You know, we went a nice pace going into the first turn, um, like we always do, and then you get talked up a little bit. And, you know, I thought, I thought we might quicken a bit earlier going into the, the, the second last turn, but... Uh, we didn't, and I saw Luke circle, and he, he got the pace going. I think if, if he didn't do that and make the pace truer, I think we could have been found in a bit of spot. I think Mama Job, Pajama would have just lobbed around in front of her and got a march on us. But um, look, great win from this filly. Take nothing away from her. Um, very happy to be on her, and just one, one, well done to Wendy once again. Colin's got a momentum. Thank you, sorry, and to Jack and Ball Gaming, thank you very much for the sponsoring of this day. It's, it's a fantastic day. Uh, I normally do well in this day, so I like it. <laughs> but um, yeah, thanks very much for the sponsorship. We really do appreciate it. All right, there we are. Colin's got a, a memento for you. There we are, the winning rider, w Warren Kennedy. Excellent job, he's third winner of the day. Right, let's speak to Cookie first, the trainer. Cook, congratulations, just listening to the rider say, temperamental filly, you have to, you, you've got on top of her, he said. Yes. Um, She's been a very difficult filly to train this, but as we've gone along with her, we've learned a lot about her, and Warren seems to get on very, very well with her. Um, we planned a program from the beginning of the season for this filly, and at every race that we've actually um, sort of had a bit of space in between, she's really relished it, and um, she doesn't carry a lot of condition. She's a typical light frame Silvano filly, but she's like a piece of elastic. And I just want to say well done. Thank you to the sponsors of Track and Ball for this race. Um, well done to the Nicholases, Bruce and Anne. She's, you know, um, so they, they can hardly talk. They're so excited. Uh, this filly has just gone from strength to strength. I'm just so proud of them. Um, well done to my staff at home. You guys are absolutely amazing. Isaac said to me the other day, ma'am, she's like a piece of elastic. She will win this race. And it's just so amazing that um, you've got, I've got the staff behind me that actually push you along every day. And uh, well done to everyone. I'm so chuffed with you all. Thank you. Well done to Warren. Great ride. Thank you very, very much. Great job. Well done. Thank you so You've much. Got a memento from Colin. Thank you. There's your winning trainer, Wendy Whitehead. Now, the winning owners, Bruce Nan and Nicholas, are also the winning breeders, Hallmark Thoroughbreds. And uh, none of them are here, Cooks, to uh, they're at home. They're at home. We're very excited. But if you can just show them their trophy, this is. Uh, for uh, Bruce and Anne, well done, terrific job. We had a very smart uh, little girl. And also, there's your breeder's trophy as well, th courtesy of uh, track and ball. Well done to all of them. So, uh, well done, Cookie, well done to the owners, well done to everyone concerned. And uh, keep on dancing has won the Oaks.